Hi, I'm Yasmin. I am 22 years old. Um, I go by she, her, and I like music and art, and that's about it, really. <laughs> I usually do a mix between digital art and then I use some of my photos or even collage pieces from like old magazines and then um, I collect all those pieces and then make it into posters through digital art. I get a lot of my inspiration from old concert posters because I make concert posters so I I get a lot of inspiration from that, like especially the 80s goth scene. They have a bunch of really cool posters during that time. And then 90s grunge posters, just like very DIY scanning situations and all that. My favorite thing to make in general is probably album covers because I get to work with the musicians. Um, Especially if they like it right away, I just like, I feel good because I feel like I understand their music and their art. But my favorite piece right now, there's a band called Magoo, their latest album. It's, a, it's my latest piece, but that one's my favorite because I pushed myself with that piece. I did, I did different things with it, so I like it. <laughs> if I were to get commissioned for an album, a cover piece for any band in Chicago, that would be super cool because I love the music scene there. Especially for a band, Twin Peaks, since they're my favorite, I'd, I'd, I'd cry, that'd be awesome. I'm Avery Victor. I am currently studying graphic design at the University of Nebraska-Lincoln. Um, and I also dabble in fine art and digital art. So generally my art is I like to mix a lot of things. Recently, I do a lot of like procreate digital drawing, um, especially with graphic design. I'm doing that a lot, but I also really love like just traditional like paper and pencil. Um, pen and paper is fun too, like ballpoint pen um, and painting. I love acrylic painting a lot, um, but yeah, right now it's a lot of digital stuff. My biggest inspiration is Tyler, the creator. He's like. I love his music, but I also just love his creativity. And so I think ever since like high school, I was like, that is like my person. I just love the way his mind works. And so I think I draw a lot of inspiration and a lot of my art from him. A dream project would be to help like do any like graphic design for a music video. Any type of thing where I can make like the, do the graphic design for like some of the background pieces. like. I would love to do a project like that. I think that'd be so fun. Or an album cover, or merchandise, or a poster, anything with music, I would love to do. Right now, I am most excited. Like, I love college. I love learning more about um, graphic design. I'm just super excited to dive into the career more, um, but also just like continue working on little side projects. I really want to work on a lot of different things. like making rugs and I love making jewelry and um, making stickers is another thing I love to do. So I'm just excited to like have more time to work on some of those personal projects and also get better at graphic design too. It's kind of hard trying to figure out uh, what we wanted to do. We kind of went back and forth with the idea. Like that was probably the hardest part. It was best if we just made art that we liked instead of having a theme, and then we kind of just smashed it all together. Um, at first we were like, let's just do like things we love. Let's just like doodle all these things we love. And then we're like, no, let's focus on music. And then we started like, the more collage it got, the more it was like, oh, this is kind of like, it's, it was giving us nostalgic vibes. I guess if we did have a theme, it would be nostalgia. Um, we wanted it to be Basically like what you would want your walls to look like as a 10 year old in the early 2000s. And so that's kind of how we just decided like to just make tons of things from the past. I put a little bit of what I would draw in my personal notebooks, but a little bit more stylized since I'm not drawing like a 10 year old anymore. <laughs> and then, yeah, I just kind of thought about like all the things that I loved when I was like six. <laughs> I just hope people really like the zine. It's just like, 
it's got a little, I wouldn't say it's like humorous necessary, but there's just little parts of it that I thought were just funny. Like, I hope people like look at it and are like, oh yeah, I totally remember that, like bug juice. I, I loved bug juice. <laughs> like, I just hope people like get a little giggle out of it. It's interesting getting to know a person through their artwork and not actually having a real conversation. So I feel like I know Avery, but it's weird because I've never met her or seen her in real life. So it's kind of cool. I feel like I've got a friend, but I've never met her before, so. <laughs>